Hi, I'm Kelsey Boss, Doctor of Physical Therapy of Focus and Pediatrics and founder of Compleo, where our goal is to set your family up for success from day one. So as someone who's incredibly passionate about development and giving our children the environment and skills that they need to grow is answering the question, how do I prevent flat head? We get that question all the time. I don't want my baby to have a flat spot on the head. Um, it's also called plagiocephaly. So the best thing you can do to prevent flat head is skip all of the devices. We don't need the little head pillows. We don't need um, to be in a swing or a rocker all day long. We need to put our children on the floor and let them explore their environment from those first couple of months. The other piece of advice I can give you is um, making sure you're still following safe sleep practices. I think a lot of people get nervous about children sleeping on their backs that's not going to give them a flat spot alone as long as you are following tummy time to play. So we do back to sleep and then a lot of us skip tummy time to play. Now, a lot of times our babies are just born with a flat spot because of how they were positioned in utero. You didn't do anything as a parent to create it. You followed all the the official recommendations, maybe you follow a whole bunch of pediatric PTs online and have all the right developmental setups and toys and your child still has that little bit of flat spot. That's okay, that totally happens. That's when you're gonna want to bring in a physical therapist and they are gonna help you with um, specific manual therapy techniques and positioning techniques that are specific to your child's presentation um, to help that flat spot go away. What we do know is early intervention is really important here. So my babies who come to me a couple months old with a flat spot, a lot of times we can correct it pretty quickly. Um, if you wait till seven, eight months to address this torticollis and plagiocephaly, it can look like a lot more physical therapy sessions, um, a lot longer to resolve. And we really do want to think about correcting this because it can affect how sports helmets fit, glasses fit, a lot of different things later on in life. So if you notice a flat spot, just head to a pediatric PT. You can get a screen without a doctor's order. They will check in on that for you and give you some individual advice.